Hello and welcome to Hank Games Without Hank. My name is John Green. I'm the manager of the Swindon Town Swiddly Poopers. We're playing Stoke City. They're in the Premier League. We're in the Championship. Why are we doing that? Because this is the Capital One Cup. Do not let me forget that this is the Capital One Cup and ergo there might be, uh, what do you call it? Extra time and or penalties. Um... As you can see, we're starting our best team. John Green, Leroy Williamson, Fireball Wilson, Roberts on one side, The Judge on the other. Green Eggs and Fodderingham are Ensign in goal. Uh, and Ginger McShane and Silva E. Silva E. Silva E. Silva E. Silva heading up our efforts in the back. We are going to need their help because Stoke City have an impressive, they're an impressive team. They're a lot better than we are on paper, but these games aren't played on paper. They're played via pixel. We can do this. All right, we're going to do question Tuesday today. Meredith, what is my first question? What is my favorite board game? Mm, it's actually quite tough. It's like one of my... Oh, that's... You just got, that's a penalty! That's a penalty! That's a penalty! Oh, you don't have to like it, Hooth! You don't have to like it one bit, Mr. Hoothy! Oh, God. Wordsworth. No. No, 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 no. 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 No, 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 no. No. Wordsworth. Wordsworth? I mean, Green Eggs in Fodringham is better at penalties than you are. Well, that's an idea. Meredith, is that crazy? Meredith doesn't think it's crazy. I don't think it's crazy either. I think it's brilliant. Wait, he's terrible at penalties. He All right, I can do this. and Fodderingham! He scores when he wants! He scores when he wants! Ends in Wesley Crusher, Fodderingham! He scores when he wants! Swindon hero! Swindon hero! We love you! Oh, what a finisher! Oh my god. We're gonna need it. We're gonna need his confidence for the rest of the game and that's gonna help! He's a finisher. He is an absolute finisher. Oh, are you messy, are you messy, are you messy in disguise? What a hero, and what a servant to the people and the city of Swindon he has been. Oh, I love it. My favorite board game is Risk, and I just showed it by showing you what I, how I can take risks. Ah, oh, yeah. Bob John! No! I, oh, he doesn't play for us anymore. What's my next question? Which superhero is most likely to be a nerd fighter? That's a good question. Um, it's not Batman. It's not Superman. Oh, it's definitely Spider-Man. He's crazy nerdy, and he's a teenager. I mean, that's pretty. That seems pretty obvious to me. It's got to be Spider-Man. Um, yeah, I think Spider-Man probably is a nerd fighter. You know who else is a nerd fighter? Benedict Cumberbatch. All right, come on. That's a nice looking. That oh, other John Green. You've got to sort of like turn your body to that ball. Maybe we need to take you ballroom dancing sometime so you learn some new moves. All right, what's next? Do I prefer doing peanut butter face or Sharpie face? Well, peanut butter face feels more exfoliating. Um, yeah, I, I prefer peanut butter face. Sharpie face takes a long time to get off, and peanut butter face is pretty straightforward. Um, that said, I don't love either um, from a purely selfish point of view, but, you know, I'm willing to suffer for my art. Oh, Leroy Williamson. Leroy Williamson. Leroy, oh, he's trying to be too fancy. I feel like Leroy Williamson lately has been a little bit too fancy. Oh, great turn, but it all for nothing. Okay, what's my next question? Tacos or burritos? Um, burritos. To me, that's not even really a question. I like soft tacos, um, but the main reason I like them is, that beca is because they're like tiny little burritos. Yes, that's great defense. Stay in front of it. Stay in front of it. He who shall not be named. Okay, good job, guys. Nope. 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 No. Yes. Oh, at the last possible second. Every. Nope. Yes. Yes. Oh, I know. I know. I need to use the X button a little more. I know. Let's just stay calm. Let's remember who's winning this game. The Swoodily Poopers are. So everybody... Just stay cool, stay collected, pass to huge. No, obviously I wasn't trying to pass the other team. What's my next question, Meredith? How do I cheer myself up? Oh, I like to read to cheer myself up. And then I also, um, I don't know, I like to do, it's part, it's part of why I write to cheer myself up. 
Um, I don't. I, I get cheered up by doing things kind of by myself, by being, um, by having some me time, as they say. Um, that's what I find relaxing. So I guess that's what I do. Is whatever it is, whatever it is that I do, kind of for, for you know, uh, for my own time. Get in that goal! Oh, these these Premier League goalkeepers get down so fast. They're just really good at going to ground. All right, what's the next question? Angel or Spike? This is going to be an awkward moment. Um, I'm not even ready to tell tell people that that. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna make a guess and I'm gonna say Angel. I'm right. Okay, I'm right. That's good. Oh, speaking of right off the post, right off the post. Oh, if only I'd watched more Buffy, I probably would have gotten that right. Get it! Leroy Williamson! Leroy Williamson, you've got to hustle to that ball, my friend! All right. Sorry. Um, you know, there's so much, uh, th you know, there's so many things that I, th 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 that I love. Oh, God. We make them further him, has it? Um, Star Trek The Next Generation, I can talk about all day. The vampire slaying stuff and its spin-offs and, and Whedon in general, it's not my verse. It's not my, it's not my universe. We're winning thanks to a goal from Green Eggs and Fodringham. Oh, it was a beauty. Okay, here we go. Here we go into the second half. Winning against Stoke City. All we need to do is not give up a goal. But if you might remember from previous games of Swoodly Poopin, that is not that was not a foul. I we were doing a little knee stuff, but I was touching the ball while I was touching his knees, and there was it was sensual, but I don't think it was illegal. Green eggs and Fodringham. Oh, brilliant at the front, brilliant at the back. Man of the match, no doubt about it. Come on, guys, better passing. What's my next question, Meredith? Favorite breakfast food? I'm not a huge breakfast eater, but I do enjoy a bay. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God! Oh. I'm still alive in the Capital One Cup. I do enjoy the occasional bagel with cream cheese. I like, I like all breakfast foods. The problem I have with, well, what are called breakfast foods. That's an example of oppression. Get it, get it, get it! Finish! Oh! You've, in that situation, you've just got to finish. You've got to find a way. Got to find a way to finish. Um, yeah, I, I, I like the foods that are associated with breakfast, but I enjoy eating them later in the day when I'm actually hungry and not, um, not recently awoken. Um, so, yeah, maybe I, I know people say that's bad for my health or whatever, but I can only tell you what I like to do. All right, what's next? My favorite city to be in? Well, I love Amsterdam. Um, I've loved... Amsterdam for many many years and I have feel very like happy there and um, but my favorite city to be in right now is Indianapolis because that's where my family lives and that's where my home is and you know that's gonna be my favorite uh, you know a home is places are mostly made out of people and for me that's that's uh, right now that's Indianapolis um, but I don't know I like a lot of places I enjoy traveling I liked Sydney a lot in, in Australia um, I don't know. But yeah, I guess Amsterdam's my favorite city. Definitely my favorite city. I'm always like really happy when I'm there because I'm usually on vacation and it's so pretty and the people are really cool and yeah, I like it there. So, oh God. All right, what's my next question, Meredith? Did you see when that hit the post? Green Egg and him. made a save and hit the post and I peed on myself. The best football match I've ever seen is the 2005 Champions League final. That's not even a competition. It's not even close to a competition. 2005 Champions League final. Maybe the best. Fo oh, God. Oh. Football match that anyone has ever seen in all of human history. It was that good. Um, I mean, the Manchester, the, the last five minutes of, the, of last year's Premier League were very exciting. Um, but to me, the 2005 Champions League final, I mean, it's just it, it, the, the whole entire game. Forget the fa fact that I'm a Liverpool supporter, so obviously, like, it was amazing. Um, the whole entire freaking game, it was just, like, the tension, particularly in the second half after, for those of you who don't know, Liverpool came from 3-0 down um, with three second-half goals within six minutes of each other and then held on till penalty kicks and then won on penalties. Um, but for the, I, I mean, it's just the tension for the last, like, hour was just unbelievable. Like, is just un 
I, I would say unbearable, except that we all bore it. I mean, it, it, it was born, but it was the most intense feeling I've ever had about, um, not just about sports, but really about any, really any variety of experience. Like, it was so, it was just un, un, unimaginable. I mean, I, I'd never experienced anything like it, and it went on and on and on and on. I got fouled again, but I'm not going to get credit for it because life is full of disappointments. Um, still, I am winning with just 10 minutes left. We just have to hold on for 10 minutes. What's, what's the next question? Oh, uh, uh, favorite restaurant? My favorite restaurant in Indianapolis is called Recess. It's very good. It's one of those restaurants where you don't get to pick what you eat. There's a different menu every night, and the chef decides it. Oh, no! Anything but this! Anything but this! No, 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 no! Oh! Schmook! All right. Let's get a goal. Let's get a goal, guys. Come on. Let's just, you know, let's go find a way. We've gotten close a couple times. We hit the post. We can do this. This is a winnable game. Vandalovsky is exhaustalovsky. Oh. What are you doing not getting to the ball, Bostock? You're better than that. Sorry, I'm getting angry now. I'm getting frustrated because I like to win and I hate to lose. There we go. We'll probably have one time for one more attack. One more attack. That's a nice ball. God, Bandolovsky's so tight. What? What was against the rules there? Come on. Oh, you got to get to that ball, John Green. You are our best player. You've got to play like it. You are our hero. All right, we're going to go to extra time. We can win this game. Meredith, give me one more question. Lord of the Rings or Star Wars? That's actually really hard. Um, I'm going to go, I mean, Lord of the Rings for the overall sort of, well, the universe of Star Wars is really enhanced by books too, but the Lord of the Rings books are really special to me. So I'm going to go Lord of the Rings just for the books, but Star Wars is great. I think Star Wars is kind of an underappreciated universe and not 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 only for George Lucas but for everybody who's donate who's like devoted so much uh okay so I'm gonna I'm gonna do a couple weird things here I'm gonna bring in Andy Rooney and I'm gonna put him out on the right side our only other option for the for right midfield is awesome Dawson who's a 55 in terms of skill level he's fast he's good forget it I'm gonna do awesome Dawson he's I love him I know he's not great but I just don't care I'm gonna bring on Andy Rooney um uh, for Wordsworth, and then how are the boys in the back looking? Bandolovsky is exhausted. I'm going to bring on Ginger Rampage to be, to be in his position. It's a runny position, and he's still got some energy. So those are my substitutions. This is just, we just, this is, I just, I, I hate extra time, and I hate penalties, and I'm, you can't help but be anxious about the, the prospect of, penalties against uh, Stoke City. I mean, that's uh, that's pretty serious business. It's not like, uh, you know, whatever teams we've been having penalties against, this is serious. We've got to win this game. And the thing is, we can win it. We've outplayed our opponents dramatically. Um, well, not dramatically. It's been close, though. All right, what's my next question, Meredith? Do I ever run out of video ideas? Sometimes. I mean, I don't run out as such, but, like, there are video ideas. Oh, God, you're better than that. You need a better first touch. There are video ideas sometimes where I, I don't know if it's going to work or, yeah, I mean, and, or I don't know what I want to make my video about this Tuesday. Sure. I mean, we've been doing this for, what, is it seven years? A long time. And um, so naturally there's going to be some times when you're just like, wow, what am I doing? But... I mean, the great thing is that nerd fighters can always sort of, like, give us ideas. Um, so if I'm ever in, an, in a real idea rut, I do turn to, to Nerdfighter and ask their advice. Oh! Do the robot, sir! He's big, he's tough, he has a brilliant puff. Other John Green. Other John Green. Yes, finally, he found an opening through that Stoke City defense, and he proved why he is a world-class John Green, arguably the greatest John Green in all of FIFA 13. Oh, is he better than his husband? I don't know, but he's becoming a great, oh God, a great player. Why did you do that turn so fast? 
I, I used the X button. I want to be credited for having used the X button properly for once. Okay, go, go. Kill time. Don't be afraid to kill time. Just take your time on this. Okay, that's it. That's the end of the first. Meredith, I can't handle any more questions if that's okay because I really got to focus on the second half of extra time here. I got to win this game. All right, it's 2-1. We, we only have 15 minutes to kill. To be fair, we only had 10 minutes to kill last time. We couldn't do it. Come on. No, no, anything but that. Got to get the ball back. Got to get the ball back, guys. Now it's just possession football. Possession football. Yes. You see that guy making a run? You see that? Yes. Oh, that's pretty. It's awesome, Dawson. It's awesome, Dawson. People said, oh, you shouldn't bring him into the game. But look at him. Look at him. Look at his control. Awesome, Dawson. Leroy Williamson. Leroy Williamson. Oh, the Oh. Oh, I thought that was it. Oh, I'm sick to my stomach from the pressure. Leroy Williamson. I don't know why your, why, why your idea, big idea there was to shoot, sir. Oh, because he's Andy Rooney. He loves to shoot. Mm, 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 mm. No! No! Come on. All right, if we go to penalty kicks, I just want to remind you that we've already scored one of them in this game, so there's no reason we can't score another. But, or lots more. I'm probably going to have to score more than one. Um, but do we have to go to penalty kicks? Maybe not. Maybe we can find a goal. Maybe it'll be through Leroy Williamson. Oh! All right, blow the whistle, ref. Okay, we're going to penalty kicks. Oh, my goodness. I hate penalties. All right, boys, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Green eggs and Fodringham, Green eggs and Fodringham. He's the greatest Fodringham of all time. It's off the post! How do you like them eggs? How do you like them eggs? He had it covered, though. Ginger Rampage, Ginger Rampage. Oh, Ginger Rampage, Ginger Rampage. Ginger Rampage has a soul. Green eggs and Fodringham. Oh, I, I thought I should go right. I was, oh. Okay. Andy Rooney. Andy Rooney. Andy Rooney. Andy Rooney. Andy. We have so many gingers on this team. Andy Rooney. Andy Rooney has a soul. Oh, he missed. Okay. Okay. Oh, God. Okay. Awesome Dawson. Awesome Dawson. Awesome, Dawson. Oh, it's not a great, it's not a great penalty. But it's good enough. It's good enough. He's a 55 skill level, but he's a hundred heart. All right, here it is. Green Eggs and Fodringham, the greatest keeper, arguably, in the history of Swindon Town. He's right there. Okay. Oh, I will eat them in a boat. I will eat them on a float. Green Eggs and Fodringham. Green Eggs and Fodringham. He scores a goal. He stops a penalty. And the Swindon Town Swindley Boobers are moving forward in the Capital One Cup. Thank you for watching. Best wishes.